Hey, how are you doing? I would like to say if you're not subscribed, please subscribe to my channel. I'm going to be talking about various topics and I'm sure you don't want to miss it. So stay tuned and enjoy. No means no. If someone is trying to pressure you to do something that you don't want to do and you say no, I don't want to do this. Well, the person that's pressuring you to do something that you don't want to do should respect that you said no and stop pressuring you to do what you don't want to do. They shouldn't just keep pressuring you and pressuring you and pressuring you after you said no, because you said no. And I don't know why some people, you say no. I don't want to do this, so please stop asking me to do this. And then they'll keep asking and keep asking and keep asking after you literally just said no. That is so disrespectful. Like respect someone's answer and also, if someone wants to talk about something and if you say, no, I don't want to talk about this. And then they keep trying to pressure you and pressure you and pressure you to talk about what you just said you didn't want to talk about. If you say no, that means no. So they should respect, hey, you don't want to talk about this. So let's talk about something else. Not I'm going to keep pressuring you and pressuring you and pressuring you until you change your mind. Because that shows that they're being completely disrespectful to you and just disrespecting your decision, which is rude. And if someone or multiple people keep pressuring you to talk about what you don't want to talk about, to do something that you don't want to do, don't give in. Don't just say, okay, I'll do it. And then they're like, yes. Or don't say, fine, we can talk about it. When you just literally said you didn't want to talk about it, do not do that. You stand firm. If you said no, well, you better stand on that no. Because the thing is, if someone is pressuring you to do something, to talk about something you don't want to talk about, and if you say no, and then they keep pressuring you. They keep asking you, asking you, asking you. And then before you know it, you just say, okay, we can talk about it. Or okay, I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it. And then if you keep doing that over and over again, then they're going to realize, you know what? When you say no, I can get you to change your mind. So then when you say no, they're not going to take your no seriously because they're just gonna think, well, every time you say no, you always do what I want you to do. You always talk about what you said you didn't want to talk about and also, don't be afraid to tell somebody no. I know at times you might like, obviously, if it's an adult, you can say it respectfully, but to other people, you know, your friends or whoever, don't be afraid to tell them no. Don't say or don't even think, well, I don't want to tell them no because I don't want them to think I'm a scaredy cat or them to think that I'm not fun or anything else you could possibly think that would hinder you from saying no. No means no. If you don't want to do something, Speak up, say no, I don't want to do this. If you don't want to talk about something, speak up and say no, I don't want to talk about this. Don't do and don't talk about something that you don't want to talk about because you don't want to feel a certain way because you're doing things and talking about things that you literally said no to. So when you say no, that means no. And if you have friends that don't want to respect your decision, people around you that don't want to respect that you said no, find some new people to associate with, find some new people to hang out with. But when you say no, that means no. Thank you for watching. And if you're not subscribed, don't forget to subscribe. I'll be posting more videos, so stay tuned. Until the next video.